uh, berry oil is a I don't, I don't want to take so much. Like I could talk about berry oil for 15 minutes. That's a very powerful supplement. And I mean, atro calcium, wonderful, wonderful supplements, truly. Yes. So let me, let me quickly, um, let me quickly call up someone else. Let me call up another speaker. Hi, okay, answer, could you unmute your mic, please? And share with us, share with us your favorite um, supplement story. Is she there? I hope Network hasn't knocked her out. I can see her here, really. Oh. I am. I okay. am here. Oh. And I've been battling with Network also. Oh. <laughs> so, where do I start from? <laughs> what are my favorites? I mean, I've explored this supplement. I'm just going to start with um, Athra. Athra for me is like magic. Okay, so um, 2003, I hurt my back. I had multiple slipped discs and I had to seek medical assistance abroad. It was a very expensive venture for years. I was constantly going in for checks. I had a minor surgery. I was constantly going in for checks every four months, you know? And then um, one day, I mean, I just got tired. I started pushing my checks to six months, a year. And of course it was getting a bit more expensive because the more I was going, the more, you know, the price was coming up, little things they were discovering. So when I started taking Azure, okay, before then I started um, seeing a chiropractor. And in the one year I started seeing the chiropractor, you know, with relief. I started taking Athra. I still have some of my um, sessions unattended as a chiropractor. So um, it's, it just, all of a sudden you just feel, you'll not feel pain again. I stopped feeling pain in my back. I stopped, I started wearing my heels. These are things I, I, I celebrated because I had stopped wearing my heels and I love my heels. And then um, you just feel good. So for me, I feel like the Athra lubricates the joints. That's the experience I have personally. And then um, Cordyceps. Cordyceps for me is, I call it the internal organ renewer. The first person that experienced Cordyceps was my dad. I just figured I wasn't big on supplements. I've taken a lot of drugs in that same period. I was on a lot of medication for my back and I was a bit I was not going to go take any other cordyceps to add to my, you know, my lump of <laughs> medication. So I asked, my dad said to me, oh, my cordyceps has finished. Uh, could you send me another one? That was in the early, early stages of uh, my business. So I said to him, this cordyceps you're taking, what does it do for you? He said he can't place his finger, but he feels good in the body. And that's how far he told me. But he said, oh, but it's really, really good. And so I started taking cordyceps. Do you know that in, um, in the time frame of my family taking the cordyceps, we've not, we've not um, my daughter is a little bit asthmatic and um, she has not had so much recurrence as she used to, of course, cordyceps and the mouth freshener when, you know, it's, it's a major part of her day care. And um, it's just, a product I think everybody should take, even if you don't take it every month, you can take it once in every three months, sort of like powers your entire body, okay? Then the Menjin, hmm. I used to hear that that was a powerhouse, you know, people are so secretive or they just don't want to share this thing. And out of curiosity, they'll tell you, okay, that you shouldn't take it if you have fibroids. And you know, I shared that incident of um, some time ago of my fibroid experience that expelled after continuous use of the Sanchez fall on the panty line. So I said, okay, I think I'm a bit free of fibroids. I guess I can take it now. Uche, nobody is talking, no. they don't say these things. Oh, the womanly <laughs> feeling alone is not even, is not comprehensible, is not negotiable. You just feel really good, lubricate, moisturizes you. My children are here, let me not, you know, talk too much, like, you know, but I was like, how come people don't talk about this thing? This is like a problem a lot of women have, dryness, and this is 
such a miracle. And people are not shouting it from the rooftops. And if you pick 10 women, there are like eight of them who have this challenge as they grow older, as menopause comes in. Like we should all be on this beautiful dreamy pills. They call it dreamy capsules now, right? So um, let me see. Apart from the libao, which I've experienced. Yes, you do feel honey. Thank you. Apart from libao, which I've experienced through the guys, I have a few people that have checked it out for me. And um, let's see which other supplements now. Berry oil. Let me talk about berry oil. Berry oil for me is an all-rounder. It's like taking my evening primrose. I did used to joke with my evening primrose. And so this is my substitute now. Do you know I also pop the berry oil into my body cream? Like I use it as part of my beauty regimen. And sometimes when I feel tired around the eyes, I just take a little and put it, apply it around my eyes. And it's almost like instant magic, like the revival around your eyes. Then I put it in my hair. I use it as part of my hair cream. I use it as my pedicure, for, uh, part of my pedicure. And I swallow it. So you glow. And yes, there's something I didn't talk about mentioning. You know that you actually glow from using it because it's hormonal and it sort of like balances your hormones. So all those dark spots, all those uneven spots that come with aging that people say they experience because I just feel I keep on glowing and glowing and glowing and um, these products just keep on doing the right thing. Thank you. My daughter brought me a Santa hat and says I must wear this. So here it is. <laughs> and... Um, so uh, I, I keep on taking these things and it is not a one-off. You have to be dedicated in taking this. You know, you actually have to, you have to be conscious. You have to be very intentional about your supplements. Some people do not realize it could be the, the difference between life and death. And I also found out that somebody that was in the isolation ward was being given um, cordyceps in the COVID-19 ward. He said they were dispensing cordyceps to them. You know, and I don't, I don't doubt it because you do know that this cordyceps is, um, it's very good for the respiratory system. Also, it's, it's, it's like taking your antibiotics. I don't want to call it the antibiotics, but it sort of like helps your upper respiratory. I've told you my daughter who's asthmatic goes on, she takes the cordyceps. And when I feel a bit chesty too, and I do cordyceps for like two, three weeks, and you begin, begin to bring up stuff, you just feel like a little bit of soothing in your chest. All right, so um, Uche, did I cover them? Calcium, calcium, calcium is like everybody should be on calcium. That is a bone repair mechanism that we have there in a little bottle. It just is magical. I call our supplements magical. And even though people say, oh, but I didn't experience, I say, but you just have to be consistent. So for the calcium, it's very good for the bones, it's very good for the teeth, it's very good for the nails, it's good for, it's, and it's so tasty, like it's so very tasty. It's so milky, the children like it. So even if they were not going to be taking their other supplements, you'll find out that calcium, somebody is popping. The first time one of my success, one of my uh, team members bought calcium, she almost downed half of it in my office. I was like, please do, this thing is just, you have to be mindful. So, oh, it is so nice to take and the children love it. You just put it on the dining table and they're taking their calcium. So, I mean, I could go on, but um, I know that um, I'm also looking forward to hearing other people's experiences with this medication. Yes, if you have dry cuticle, like, you know, the dry bed, nail bed, sometimes you have hangers, nail, and a little bit of, you know, dry skin hanging there. You should just pop your berry oil and massage it into your nail bed, like so. You'll be amazed. Wow, wow. Hey. Thank you, thank you, sis. Lovely, lovely, lovely. I love your Santa hat. I, I think I should them. get one. <laughs> you should. <laughs> Looks very nice. <laughs> thank all you. All right, all right. Berry oil is, is an amazing supplement. My sisters used to have terrible, terrible ulcer. Terrible ulcer. And the type that, I mean, they would have to be on admission and it was always very dramatic anytime they had an episode. So um, it was, it was, it was, it was just on and on, on and on, both of them. And I mean, the other day I asked, I asked one of them, I said, what was the last time you had ulcer? She said, what? What is ulcer? <laughs> it's been like, it's been like five years since she had ulcers because of berry oil. It's so, so good. It's so, so good. Okay. So I'm going to call someone, another speaker. Let's see. Hi, Mrs. Murphy. Are you here? Can you unmute yourself, please? 
Okay, hello everyone. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. My name is Sekuchi. Good morning. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, so hmm, supplements. First of all, let me start by saying that I've always hated taking anything, pills, supplements, and all that. Growing up, I was the type of child that doctors would like, is this child normal? Because I would ask you, is there an injection for this? I would <laughs> rather you inject me than give me pills and drugs. Even during my pregnancies, like I was literally throwing them out. I would put my pills in swallows and I would still throw them out. So for me to be talking about supplements, that is the first miracle, first of all, <laughs> because I hate and I hate, I rather I hated popping pills. But I joined Longreach at a time whereby I don't know what happened, but I sure had an accident a week after joining Longreach. And it had to do with, you know, like my, my I, well, I was hit by a truck. So my leg, my hand, you know, my right thing, my right thumb, everywhere was like literally numb. The bones were, I don't know, it was the grace of God that they were not broken. And prior to that, in fact, two weeks before the accident, I had just managed to complete my therapy with my physiotherapist because I was experiencing this thing they call lumbar spondylitis. I don't know if it's spondylitis or spondylitis, but I was experiencing that. And with my kind of job as a weight loss coach, before I used to post lots of workouts, activities and all, but I couldn't do any of that. In fact, I was told to stay off anything strenuous, no bending, no lifting, just walk, dance, walk. So when I joined Longreach, I think it came at the right time for me because I just decided to trust the supplements. I just said to trust the products. So I started taking the atro and the calcium. You know, if I, to tell you how I hate, um, how I hate tablets, I swallowed, I use, I use water to take the calcium. I can't chew the calcium. It's just recently I was there trying to chew the calcium, but because I knew I needed it, I'll just, you know, close my eye and throw it in. And I noticed that my, my healing was very, very fast because they didn't really give me drugs like that in the hospital. It was just mainly like paracetamol, just painkillers per se. But the main issue, my waist, because I just finished therapy, then imagine a truck hitting my whole right side. So it was almost as if my waist shifted. You know, I was able to bend at some point. And now, see me, I couldn't bend anymore. Like I was literally behaving like an old woman. But within like two weeks, the healing was so fast. I remember I even had an event with Dr. ID and they were even surprised that I was even walking, you know, I was dancing. I, you know, tried to do some dance steps. I was able to walk. And, you know, when I think back, I think the atro and the calcium were the products I was really using very well. So I'm going to give it to them. I think they did a great job with my healing because I don't think my healing would have been that fast. Then um, another product I'd like to talk about is the Cordyceps. Cordyceps, this one, I fell in love with it earlier, but recently my love for it like tripled. Sometime during the NSAS protest, I was very, very down. I could not breathe. I could not, but I was coughing. I could not smell anything. Like I would literally spray five perfumes on my hand and like nothing, no smell. I was like, is it COVID? What could this be? It was really, really frustrating. And there was no movement. There was 24 hours coffee in Lagos. So like, what exactly was I supposed to do? And prior to that, I treated malaria. I couldn't even get what was wrong with me. So I remember I was, Dr. Idi would always call and check up on me. She'd be like, Ms. Mafia, are you fine? I'd be like, doc, I don't know. You know, this thing is not getting better. And she now said, have you been taking your Cordyceps? And I was like, I forgot I had Cordyceps. <laughs> Oh boy, I popped my cordyceps and by the time I popped it, within like three days, you know, you would not believe what the sense of smell does for you. I don't know how I just passed my husband and I perceived, like, I just perceived small perfume. If you see the joy in my heart, I was like, hey, Jesus, as in, this is how I would have probably gone. Like, I was excited. He was like, was it that bad? I was like, you don't get it. Like, if food was burning in my presence, I would not have perceived it. It was that bad. So since then, I do not joke with my cordyceps. Like, I, I think I've finished two bottles. I know I may be taking too much, but because of COVID and all that, that's like the strongest immunity booster I have. So I have to take it. I am not joking with it. Sorry, I, time, time, time. Another um, amazing um, um, supplement I'm going to talk about is the berry oil. Now, the berry oil, 
my husband said, that thing you're taking, please don't stop. <laughs> All I can say for the first the first aspect, like I didn't even know anything was happening, but I just realized that when there is a touch, there was no reflex. Even if you're a married woman, yeah, you understand there was no reflex, there was just a welcoming, like, okay, <laughs> let's go on. <laughs> so it was more like that thing, eh? Please don't stop. And then I noticed again that there was this dress. I was going for an event and the dress, you know, it did not have a, you know, like the bust pad, but it just had the breast form, you know, like it was a nice lace dress. And I just even said, let me try myself with my former slipper. So I was like, let me try myself. And I wore this dress and I just felt like I had oranges, like everything was firm and standing. I was like, oh boy. So this very oil is also a femur. <laughs> if you did not get that gist, I am sorry. <laughs> I am sorry. But it actually firms up the sleeper. So those of you moms that are here, you've been breastfeeding and you just feel like all your heroes are falling down. I can assure you that the bones, dead bones, dry bones shall rise again. Be steadfast in taking your berry oil. <laughs> Then another testimony with the berry oil is I have this friend. She has a son. He's, um, he's 16. He has very bad eye issues, always bringing out discharges. They're taking him to several. But I think they were supposed to like recommend a surgery for him. She joined Longridge. And one of the first products she bought was berry oil. I kid you not. In one week, one week, she said she just realized that her son's eyes, there were no discharges. And he said he was seeing so clear. She was like, how? How is this possible? She told him to stay off the berry oil for a few days. He stayed off the berry oil. Those discharges started coming back. So she now said, oh, okay. So this berry oil is what is doing the magic. She said she chattered. She told him, she said, I cannot be going out to be looking for money and I'll have to remind you to take your berry oil. Every day you must take your berry oil. And by today, this boy's eyes are as clear. He hasn't gone to the hospital in a while. Although, yes, he will go for his regular checkup. But it's amazing. Like, the testimony is, like, a young boy, his, the testimony is amazing. And this same boy had very bad pimples, like the big, bummy types. And then that same period, within a stretch of one month, his face became smooth. So I don't know what hormonal issues he was facing, but the berry oil did wonders. Berry oil, she did not use any other thing for her son. The berry oil. Then the last, um, the last thing I'm going to talk about, okay, sorry, the berry oil is also great for skin. Whenever I feel my skin is looking dull, I take berry oil. Berry oil has a way of making you glow. It has this internal, it rejuvenates, it heals from within. So if you have very bad pimples or very bad skin, please take the berry oil. It heals from within. Yes, our creams and soap can heal from the surface, but berry oil takes care of whatever is causing it from inside. So you may even realize that within one day or two days, it may become painful, the pimples may become painful, but after that, you will see everything drying up. You will just touch and then everything will come out and you will find yourself scarless. Like I do not joke with my berry oil for my skin. Just like Ansa said, great for hair. I pop it, it's, it's red in color. I just put it because I Googled what sea buckthorn oil does. And I realized that sea buckthorn is great for growing of nails, growing of hair, eyes, skin. So I'm like, oh, okay, if this does this, then that means it can work in different ways. Sometimes I mix with my rejuvenating and I just rub on my body. I rub, like Ansa said, I rub on my eyes sometimes. Whenever I feel my eye pressures are high, I mix with my hair cream for my edges. It is amazing. The last product I'm going to talk about is the Menjian. The Menjian, I never knew about the miracle of that product. One day I just thought of, okay, I just felt, okay, I should try this product, you know, because I just felt, okay, everybody talks about it. I already take too many supplements. So I was already tired, but I stayed off some and started to try it. One thing I noted is like, just like Ansa said, there is this, it gives you this girly feeling, like this feel good feeling. You just feel good from within. Honestly, because they said you should take it on an empty stomach first thing in the morning. So I took it and funny enough, it even kind of suppressed my appetite because I wasn't even eating too much. Then I noticed that my, my period was irregular. Even that was the same time I missed my period for like five days that I was saying, hey, Jesus, as in another, another nine months of, as in like, no, I couldn't go through it. But somehow it regulated my period again. So uh, supplements are amazing. Find what works for you, use them. 
trust them. If you have parents, please bless them with it. Least I forget the last thing, berry oil works in reducing blood pressures. This is my own dad's testimony. My dad used to complain, not, not complain, my dad used to have very high blood pressures. He has been scheduled for several operations, but he could not do those operations because before entering the theater, his blood pressures went very high. So we could not do the operations anymore. But just this year, August, that's to tell you that it took him about almost a year for his blood pressures to completely stabilize. In fact, the doctors were asking, what did you take? He had to tell them that he was on berry oil because I said, Daddy, you must take this berry oil. The, the, and the, the, lockdown pro, um, the lockdown was happening. Protest was happening. I told my downline in Oweri, I said, please, I'm going to use, I'm going to buy pro, um, berry oil. Just go and give my dad because I couldn't send it down. He took this, this is um, berry oil. Time for the surgery. The date they scheduled for him, his pressures were normal. He was okay. He did his surgery. In fact, I was even surprised when they said, oh, he had come out. And he was okay. And so far, no spike. And when I mean spike, you know when it's very, very bad, no spike. So that's my own testimony. I could go on and on. Testimonies are so many. Thank you for having me. <laughs> Thank you. Wow, wow, wow. Like that's loaded. That was loaded. Very oil, very oil is. I can't get enough of very oil. The, the, <laughs> you got people laughing. Have you seen the chat? The chat went well. Then you were talking. <laughs> When we're talking about your berry oil experience <laughs> oh my god it was really good um so let me see there are some questions here um somebody asked so yeah i mean manja makes one honey berry oil good for so diabetes yes clearly the the arthro i mean dr Heidi is going to talk more about arthro and this whole glucosamine thing so i'm going to leave that one for her really because um she's 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 a pro she's a pro she's going to talk about it but very good for diabetes, very oil, well, yeah. Um, um, can a child take, uh, I mean, there are some questions here, I'm just going to leave it for Dr. Idi. <laughs> Dr. Idi will do justice to them. Let me call the next um, speaker. Dr. Idi, I'll call her later on. Let me call, let me call someone. Um, I saw Mrs. I saw Mrs. Dockers, yes, yes, yes. Mrs. Dockers, please, can you unmute your mic? Let's hear your own story. Can you hear me, Mrs. Dockers? Okay. I saw you on mute your mic. Are you with us, Mrs. Dockers? Yes, I'm here. Okay, 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 awesome. Welcome, good, welcome. Good morning, sis. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> good, morning. Good, morning. good to see you. Good, to see good you morning. Too. Good morning. Good morning. Good to be here. Good morning, my coach. Good morning, Mark. <laughs> <laughs> um, when I joined um, this amazing platform, my mom had um, a very terrible arthritis. It was really bad. It was really, really bad. I I, um, I was not happy about the whole situation. It was, it was very bad. I gave her calcium here. I gave her arthro. My people, especially the, um, our guests, within one week, within one week, she, she was back to her feet. So if you have elderly ones, old ones, please ensure this is a life testimony. Please ensure you get calcium, you get arthro for them. Send it to them in the village. Send it to them. You know, these are products they need. It was really bad that I experienced one that she actually sat on the floor. It was that bad. So these are the products I gave her. And today, to the glory of God, you know, she's back. Um, 
Uh, oh, I hope network has not knocked her out. Are you still with us? Hello. Okay, we can hear you now. Hello. Oh, we can hear you now. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Okay, yeah, you 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 were frozen for I a bit. I can hear you. Can hear you now. I can hear you. Can you hear okay, me now? Okay, please continue. Yes, yes. Can you hear me? Yeah. Okay, did you hear the testimony about my mom? Yes, we did. Okay, okay. So mine, um, you know, most women after menstrual cycle, you know, we feel weak, we feel tired and all of that. But with language calcium, it rejuvenates me. It's, it brings me, I feel good after menstrual menstruation, you know, and later I got to know that using calcium, you know, makes our body to be in an alkaline state. And we all know that when our body is in an alkaline state, no disease, including cancer, I'm sure my coach will talk more about that. No disease, including cancer, can exist. Look at this. I have, <laughs> so please, if you are part of, if you are a guest here, please, long beach calcium, it's a must have for everyone. It protects you, it takes care of you. And for the women, this is a must have for everyone. Thank you, Lida Uchi. Thank you, thank you so much for your wonderful testimony. Thank you so, so much. Um, it just dawned on me that we haven't talked about black ginger. Black ginger. That is a wonderful, wonderful supplement. Huh? Black ginger. And uh, okay, let me also mention that, you know, Mendian, we have Mendian, and then we have the um, the Libao. Libao, I, be, I hope I'm not muted. Okay, we have Libao for men. So what you're hearing uh, um, women say, or you know, when they took Mendian, it felt good from the inside. That is ex exactly what happens to the man when he takes the bow. It is amazing. It is amazing. It 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 helps to um no audio. Someone is saying no audio at my end. Um okay. So you can hear me in the chat, please. We can hear you. We can hear you. Okay, okay. Um, somebody said you can't hear me. I think maybe it's from your end. <clears throat> so, amazing supplement for men. Um, low stem count, productive cells in men, and all that. It is for them. So, we have Libao for men. We have Mengen for. For women, we call on someone else to share their own testimony because we're quickly we're running out of time. We have just one more person. Then the Friday will. Elizabeth, please could you unmute yourself and let us hear your your product um story. First, are you with us? Yes, um, I have. Good evening. Good morning. Okay. Good morning. Good morning. Okay. Um. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm kind of stuck in traffic, so I'm just going to. <laughs> okay. I'm kind of it's stuck right. in traffic. It's all right. So yeah. Right. Walk the voice. So good morning, everyone. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yes, we can hear you. Okay, 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 okay. So good morning, everyone. Um, so Lisbeth here. I'll be sharing my personal experience with Longridge supplements. Um, well, I joined Longridge sometimes last year. I think that was around June. Yes, June. Um, well, I wasn't interested in the supplements because just like Mrs. Murphy, I don't like drugs. I don't like pills. Anything that has to do with pills, I'm out. So I don't take pills. So I was never interested in the supplements. In fact, 
I don't even know what you use some of them for. And I don't even know what some of them works for. But when it comes to pad, panty liners, the cream and all of that, I was so interested in them. I loved them, the toothpaste. I loved everything. But the supplements, they were no, no. So fast forward, June, July, August, September. I was coming back from church on a Sunday evening and I was knocked down by a bike. Can you hear me? Okay, so I was knocked down by a bike and then, you know, I was unconscious, unconscious for some hours. I was there on the floor, unconscious for some hours and a few minutes later, I was taken to the hospital. Well, I didn't know I had any inner injury because I felt it was just normal. Um, although I really didn't know what was wrong with me anyway. So when I got to the hospital, I was checked and I was, I think I was treated for shock or something. Um, but the point was when I had the accident, I discovered that I couldn't get up from the floor. So I was carried. They took me to the hospital. I couldn't walk, but I was expecting that maybe it was just a temporary thing, maybe because of the accident that hopefully when I get to the hospital, I'll be able to come down from the car and I'll walk into the hospital myself. But when I got to the hospital, I couldn't walk. They had to use a, a wheelchair. I think it was a wheelchair. Yes, a wheelchair to take me inside the ward. And on getting there, they discovered that it was more than what we could see on the surface. So I was directed to Igobi, that's the um, National Orthopedic Hospital at um, Yaba. So I was directed there. Well, as a child, I had always had this mentality, you know. OK, so I, I was directed to Yaba. And um, I was, I did a scan, I did an x-ray and we discovered that I had a fracture, a very serious fracture. So I was given, all right, all right, all right, all right. So I was given some drugs and um, as a person who didn't like drugs, I really did not take them. But somehow one of our team members got to know about it and she told me to use Atro. She introduced Atro to me. I got Atro and then I started using Atro and Calcium. A few months later, the doctor already told me that I was on POP. So the doctors already told me that I would be carrying the POP for like three months. But then a few months later, I went for an x-ray and we discovered that the bones were healing so fast. They were closing up so fast. And even most of the doctors were surprised. They were like, this does not look normal. What was I using? Is there something else? And yes, I shared with them. So fast forward, I got better. And because of the calcium and the hatro, I started walking pretty fast. In fact, I got crushes. I got crutches. I was supposed to use the crutches for months, but in less than a few days or weeks, I got the crutches. I had to discard them. They were no longer useful. I started walking. In fact, the first time I came out, I came to meet Dr. ID on the island. I came with the crutches. But a few days later, I did not need the crutches again, so I discarded them. So that was how I got my, my balance back with atro and calcium. And then just a quick one on berry oil. Um, well, we all know that some functions of berry oil is for the married women people. So those of us that are not part of the married women people, we stay away from those functions. But what I do with berry oil is, I've, I know natural as a, I, I keep natural air. So I've always known that palm oil is good for natural air, oil generally. So what I do with berry oil is I pop up the oil inside of it. I mix with my cream for my body and then I put beer on my hair like that. I just put beer on my hair and then I just wash up sometimes and it makes my hair look so nice, amazing, silky, great texture, I'm on dread. So, Great texture, everyone is always loving my dreads. If I'm walking, people are always fighting. Is it natural or artificial? Is it natural or artificial? So um, you said we should keep it short. So let's just keep it short so that we can make it for other people. Thank you. Thank you so much, sis. Thank you so, so much. Hope you get home in good time. I know you're in Lagos. I can see our bus there. So <laughs> I hope the traffic will be in your favor. <laughs> That's a serious prayer. Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh. So far, um, I mean, if you're in the audience, we would love to also hear from you. I mean, we have just 10 minutes. We just have 10 minutes. So Dr. Heidi is going to share her own experience um, from this, uh, from the supplements. And then we'll take maybe one or two people from the um, audience. So if you have a testimony that you would love to share, you have just two minutes, just two minutes to talk about it. Um, you could just raise your hand so that immediately Dr. ID is done, I will call 
I will call you um, up. So, uh, Engineerita's hand is raised. Okay, noted. Um, somebody is asking a question. What oil did she say she used on her natural hair? It's very oil. She said she used very oil on her natural hair. So she popped it into her cream and used on her, on her, on her skin. And then the bare oil itself, she just applied it directly to her, to her hair. I've also tried that. It's cool. It's cool. So, Doctor ID, are you with us? Please unmute your mic. Yes, you there. Doctor ID. Hello everyone, good morning. Um, it's a very interesting session and I know that a lot of us want to stay here like forever to just keep hearing people share their experiences is really fantastic. I'll just try and keep mine within five minutes. Um, when I first um, partnered with Longreach, reluctantly by the way, I, I didn't want to hear anything about supplements. I hated supplements. Now, one of the reasons I hated supplements, not drugs, supplements, was just because every network marketing company was only selling supplements. And because I hated network marketing, I hated supplements. It was very straightforward. Anything that had to do with network marketing, I just didn't want to hear it, right? And I signed up on Long Beach reluctantly because my husband forcefully signed me up. So when we were selecting our products, um, the he wanted to select supplements i'm like Hell, no 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 no. let's just use i love the toothpaste at the time i love the body wash i just chose products i loved and then um i was in the chat room so someday someone just said something like oh the berry oil is fantastic for the eye and i knew my husband had an eye problem so and i knew he had no problems with supplements i just told him you know what i hear this has is good for the eye i'm going to buy it for you so i bought it for him the first night so all the while all every time i since i knew my husband almost every five minutes he's pressing his stomach he has lactose intolerance and he has ulcer so and then i gave him this very oil he took it at night he took it at night he slept he woke up the next morning, woke me up and was like, what did you say you gave me last night? I said, it's very oil. He said, okay, so for the first time, I slept through the night without touching my stomach. There's something in this product. So I said, but I said it's for the eyes. He said, no, my eyes do the same, but my stomach is feeling so much better. You know, I was like, really? So he chattered the berry oil and that was... In fact, that was the beginning of the last time we actually visited the hospital. He used to go to the hospital like 2 a.m. for medication on berry. That's when the ulcer sets in. So I was so, so happy to hear that. And so we continued with the very And that, that like instigated some interest in me. And I started making, doing some research about the products, the berry oil or the supplements, literally. And I was so amazed at what I saw. The next product that caught my interest was the Cordyceps Militaris that we've talked about here. My mom kept complaining of one pain or the other, not feeling so well, just like Ansa said about her dad. So I gave her the Cordyceps Militaris. She finished the bottle. When she finished the bottle, she came back to me and told me, tell Longwich to redeem the product. It's not Cordyceps Militaris, it's Cordyceps Power, or it's Militaris Power because she felt so, so different about her body. I also gave her the actual about the same time and that chronic arthritis just shifted. Now, when I, I, had, my, when I had my son, from the first, so I mean, from when, as far as I can remember from when my son was born, up to when he was three, he was back to back to back treatment of hospitals, antibiotics, antibiotics. He was always having one blood infection, one skin, it was just one infection or the other sepsis here sepsis there. it was just always too much so back to back every month we must go to the hospital we must get admitted high fever uh, infection back and back. so this on this this occasion after i had my daughter he was just three and a couple of months i had my daughter and then my son had the infection again the blood infection and then from the blood infection it got into his eyes so his eyes got swollen so for four weeks we were in the hospital and so when we got home, I did a partner enough, I just got fed up. And so I told my husband, I'm giving him cordyceps. I picked the cordyceps leaflet. And that's when I even found out that cordyceps can be taken by children from two years. I was like, really? So I just gave him the cordyceps. I started giving him the cordyceps. I opened one capsule, I poured into that vitamin C container and I stirred it. And I gave it to him. Now, now his immunity was very poor because he didn't like he he doesn't he didn't like food. So I started giving him the cordyceps. And at the same time, I started giving him the Nutrivi Blue. Okay, now as I speak to you, my son is seven, he'll be eight in January. We've only been to the hospital for antibiotics twice. And this is someone that used to have it every day back to back. 
he started eating well. He started feeling better. He started putting on weight. And that was the last. And even at that three years, he was wheezing. So we used to go to the clinic to nebulize him, nebulize him once in a while. You know, they were like, okay, maybe he's five. He will grow the adenoids and all of that. That was my best experience with the cordyceps. And ever since then, it's a product we use at home every single time to protect ourselves. I do not joke with that product. So that was it. Then I got, the, I got diagnosed of multiple sleep disc as well. When I was, um, when I, after having my baby, I had that diagnosis of the, the sleep disc. So I was suffering from the arthritis on my knee and I had the sleep disc on my waist. So I couldn't walk because of my knee and my waist, of course. So um, I had a physiotherapist always coming to my house, always coming to my house. The first thing that helped me, by the way, was the panty liner, but the pain was still there. And then when I put on weight, when I exceed a certain weight, I noticed that the pain becomes severe. So I decided to go on the earth road. And that's how I realized that even with this weight gain, even with the weight gain, I can get up from the bed in the morning without having to hold the bed sides. Even with the weight gain, I can work. I can take my morning exercise, morning walk, and my knees do not want to go on fire. You see that after a product, you don't have to take it when you have arthritis. Don't wait. It lubricates your joint so you can take it. Now, talking about the afro for diabetes, I just want to quickly say this. Now, um, there's been some research in the past that says that glucosamine may not be good for diabetic patients. However, recent research has disproved that and said that no, it doesn't, it should be okay because it does not um, interfere with the insulin absorption. Now, I want to say this. When it comes to people like diabetic patients, hypertensive patients, if you want to introduce them to the long reach range of supplements, please don't tell them to stop their regular med medication. Because if you just stop their regular, regular medication, because this is a supplement, what, does, what do supplements do? They supplement your meals because you do not have, they try to give you the minerals, the vitamins, the things your body need to self heal, self heal. Right. So if you do not, if you go giving them the product as if it's a drug, then their system will not take it. So the supplement is to supplement and help their body self heal and gradually ease them off the medication. It's not for them to stop the medication instantly. So you give someone the long beach supplements, please let the person know that they need to continue with their medication and they need to be on close monitoring because their bodies may or may not accept the supplement. It's just like selling someone I'm giving. So people say, I'm allergic to nuts. I'm allergic to oil. I'm allergic to seafood. That could happen with a supplement because it's also natural food stuff. So you always need to let the people know that this is it. Now, another thing I want to talk about is the fact that people call cordyceps militaris um, antibiotics. Please don't. Cordyceps militaris is not an antibiotic. Cordyceps militaris is an immune booster. It gives your body, it's actually rich in cordycepine, which is a nucleotide analog. And what that does is to help boost your immune system, right? So it helps your body to self heal. And it's also very important for respiratory issues. Like anybody you know that has any respiratory challenge at all, give the person that cordyceps, you will see a significant improvement, honestly. So it's all about top immune boosters. And because it's an immune booster, it will help your body fight against my, any foreign organism. And that's why people call it antibiotics. It's not antibiotics. Cordyceps militaris is just an immune booster. I call it the power, like my mom calls it. I call it, I call it like the end revitalizer. It just restores things. You know, it has a way of renewing. I call it the renewer as well. Renewing your cells, waking up, reawakening dead cells and giving them the strength and the energy to serve. Now, the last thing is the Mengian. Another misnomer is when people say, call Mengian the fertility supplement. Please, Mengian is not a fertility supplement, no. Mengian is a hormonal balance supplement. So you don't, it's not only for those who are looking for the fruit of the womb. It's not only for those who want to be fertile. That's the mistake people have made. That product is simply to balance your hormones. As long as you're a woman who have started seeing your period, your hormones will go haywire. The Mengian is just to put it together and allow you feel the woman you should feel like. Right? So you don't have to say, because I, I don't want to get pregnant, I don't want to take Menjan. It will not make you pregnant. Just like 
use your normal protection and you'll be fine. Okay, now the male supplement, we can't talk about them today because the men folk did justice to them a couple of days, a couple of last week, right? Last week, Saturday. So you can, you can check the chats. We're going to drop the YouTube channels. You can go watch and catch up for them. Language has amazing supplements. I can go on and on and on and on. But because of time, I have to stop. Okay, so thank you very much, um, Uche. I don't know if there's anything else you wanted me to say. Thank you. Thank you, SD. Thank you so much. Yes. I'll just check the chat. There's, there's a question I saw. Um, oh, I must have missed it. Somebody asked that question. Um, I think you probably have even answered it. Okay, so someone said, what if I use Nigeria for libido and I don't want to get pregnant? How do I go about it? So you've, you've already answered that question by saying that. It's not just about, it's not just, it's just, it's not a fertility supplement. It's a hormonal balancing for women. So every, every woman can go ahead and use it. So, um, engineer Rita, uh, you have to unmute your mic. Please, please keep it short. Like one minute, we already, uh, I'm just going to take one person. And the reason why I'm calling her is because she was the first person to raise her hand. So please keep it really, really short. We want to round up so we can keep to our word. For um, promising one hour. Engineer Rita, please unmute your mic. Just one minute, please. One minute. Hello, Mark. Are you, are you with us? Your mic is muted. Your mic is muted. Um, Okay, should we carry on? All right, let me quickly um, go to the chat. I saw a few questions. So somebody was asking about how to um, use the, add the berry oil to your paper. You pop it, use a needle, clean needle, okay? Sterilized needle to just pop it and um, you know press out the oil into your cream. That's that's all you have to do. The host is not allowing you to um to unmute. Um, Engineerita says the host is not allowing her to unmute. So Heidi, could you help? Okay. Okay, my believe you're muted now. Okay, yeah. yeah. Good evening, everyone. Good evening. Good evening, everyone. Good evening, SD. Good morning. <laughs> good morning, good evening. Yeah, I just put a testimony about the calcium and one of the other supplements. Usually I don't can we hear me? Yes, we can. We can hear you. Yeah, uh, it took um when I joined this platform, I, anything supplement, I don't go near it. No, but God, I'm not taking drugs for like um, um, more than eight years. I don't take drugs. Um, I had the Dr. ID. In fact, practically, she, I, I mean, anything that has to do with um, supplements or whatever, I counted myself out. Our SD had to come personally to my house. One time I was not feeling too good and she had to give me, forced me literally to take the um, uh, Cordyceps um, coffee, you know? <laughs> she made me take it and I felt good that time. But after then, you know, I, I, I would say that I never took any of the supplements, language supplements, until this uh, lockdown period. You know, we are at home, locked down, nothing to do. And I said, okay, let me try to um, take some of these supplements and then begin to see the difference. I spent them for myself. Yeah, we well cut uh, a long story short, berry oil. I started with the berry oil. The berry oil was awesome, the Medjen. So I can categorically say that I've used all the supplements right now. Okay, and the difference is clear. So, but particularly, I want to give a testimony about the calcium. Where calcium, I was in a presentation recently, and an elderly woman came to meet me, and she was like, oh, please, could you retail just a small bit of the calcium for her, because she couldn't afford to buy the old pack. And I was like, okay, it was a health talk um, uh, organized by the Rotary Club of Nigeria, and I, I told the team, just give us some, you know. And after about 10, 15 minutes, she came back and she said, thank you, thank you, ma, thank you. I said, what is it? She said that the headache she had, you know, disap has disappeared. And that was when I realized the efficacy of calcium, you know, 
and I re remember what the doctors on this platform has said about the calcium that he had high absorbent, uh, you know, rate is 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 about more than ten times absorbed into the body. So if you take the longish calcium, you you know, in the next 10, 15 minutes, you'll be feeling good, you know, especially if you have headache. So I want to recommend that. That's the fact. I never used to recommend calcium before now, but that is one of my best, you know, uh, 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 supplements right now. Calcium, you know, because I realize that, you know, people that have headache have, you know, in touch several places, and especially some of these drivers, people that are driving Uber, you know, private vehicles, you know, with the traffic in Lagos and everywhere, people are going through a high level of stress right now. So if they just take calcium, you know, um, in the next 10, 15 minutes, they are good. And then secondly, I'll just share the testimony of a, a, a man. I mean, on Sunday, I, I was looking at him, he was driving me. I was like, ah, sir, you're looking really down. What's up? He said, I'm feeling terrible, edic, edic. I said, yes, sir. take good water, take water, take a good brand of water and take the calcium. You know, my friends, I want to tell you that within uh, 10 15 minutes of taking the, the long beach calcium, it was so good. Uh, and you know, so I really want to encourage that, that supplement that we used to overlook, the calcium, mm. it does more than what uh, MD accurately said. Yeah. I just wanted to keep that in, yes. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so, so much, Mom. My daughter keeps saying, Mommy, my calcium, calcium. Mommy, can I have calcium? <laughs> I have to keep it up so they don't mm. finish one bottle. They've learned how to open yeah. it up these days. <laughs> All right. Thank you so much, Engineer Rita, for that testimony. Yeah, thank you. We're going, to round, we're going to round up now, uh, but I will um, call Dr. Heidi because we have some questions. Let me call Dr. Heidi up. She'll take those questions and then we can go. So just, just give us five more minutes of your time. If you've gotten value from this, um, presentation. I'm sure. I'm sure you have gotten value, even because I have learned a lot tonight. I've learned a lot tonight. So, um, five minutes more to Dr. Heidi to take some questions, and then we will call it a night. All right. Thank you so much, Dr. Heidi. Over to you. All right. Thank you. Thank you. So, UJ Dot is asking, please, can women take Cordyceps Black Ginger? No, it contains Libau. Libau is only for men. Josephine, what supplement can seven years child take for pile? Go and see a doctor. Pediat children are not supposed to take supplement unless prescribed by their pediatricians. Okay. Um, can a child under four years take a shoe? No, again, children are not supposed to take supplement. What's the supplement for a diabetic patient with arthritis? For arthritis, you need the acro. Uh, for diabetics, unfortunately, we don't have a strict, strict up supplement for it. Um, but because it's something that is not curable. So what we can just say is to manage it, you can add the Nutrivi Pink and maybe taking water from the pie cup has always helped, but please closely monitored by the doctor. My um, Infinix Hot 8 is asking, my son defecates more than three times daily. He is two and this has been since his one year. If it stops after weeks or days, it continues. He has been taking drugs upon drugs. Please, is there any language product I can start giving him? This is impossible if you're seeing a pediatrician. Maybe you're just getting drugs from pharmacists. Please go to a proper teaching hospital and see a pediatrician for several tests. A two-year-old cannot take long beach products, not recommended. What can someone take for sunburn and dark circles under the eyes? You already heard other people say they use menjan. Please use menjan. Um, this one has been answered. Please, if you have lower back pain, kindly tell me what you use, what to use. Yes, like I said, for lower back pain, what I used was, first of all, the panty line, I really did help. And then I used the... Um, the energy shoes, but what has been sustaining me, I don't use the energy shoes anymore, is the arthro. The arthro is fantastic. And then try to maintain, manage your weight. Um, then I see someone else say, is it advisable to soak the onion strip in the panty liner or whatever? No, we had talked about this when you get sanitary napkins. Please go and get the pie cup. It does a better job. Don't soak anything and drink. It's not healthy. Okay, so we'll say that again. Um, Please can bury all be taken at the same time with cordyceps. I strongly do not recommend it because um, they both are, they are very, very powerful. Even when you're giving cordyceps to a child who needs it because of health issues, you must make sure the child eats well. The same thing with the berry oil, the child needs to eat well. So please, I recommend you finish one before you start the other. That's my own personal recommendation. Um, so I think that's all the question I've seen. 
Um, can a child of five years take Cordycep and what dosage? Like I said, unless there's this very, very serious illness that needs to be treated, then you can give that child one a day. But if it's just for immune boosting, no. Just let the child eat well, give the child occasionally water from the pie cup that should do. But if the child is having a recurrent a health challenge and she's been on medical um, treatment and needs an additional um, thing to take, then you can issue, you can give the credit secretaries and monitor closely as well. Right, so I think that's all the questions. Um, we have our next session on Tuesday, by the way. So let's um, also be ready for Tuesday. So like I see some more. And what is advised for gastric ulcer patients? We've talked about this severally today. Berry oil is very important. And then taking water from the pie cup is super important. I mean, they will not remember when they last had that gastric ulcer. Can a diabetic patient take us through? I've also responded to that. Yes, but closely monitored by the doctor. Thank you very much, Uchenna, back to you. Thank you, thank you so much, SD. Thank you so much, everybody who contributed tonight. Um, program you have all oh, made I'm so very sorry, very Richard, that's a question from facebook so sorry about okay this. oh so okay. i just checked facebook now please which supplements can a stroke patient take stroke is a nervous issue and got a no longer supplements can help but just probably to keep the energy levels up we'll say okay let the actual come in let the cordyceps come in but they need constant physiotherapy and they need constant um medical care as well thank you all right Thank you so much, everybody. Thank you to our speakers. Our speakers tonight, you're all awesome. Big thanks to Mrs. Murphy, Ghana, Engineer Rita, Doctors, Elizabeth, Ansa, Dr. ID, and of course, my humble self. <laughs> now, Lizard, nine day not for himself. Nobody else, yes. not for the Lizard. <laughs> Thank you so much. I hope you all have a wonderful, wonderful night and um, a lovely weekend. We will see you next week. Don't miss episode six. Episode six, right? Yeah, episode six. Yes. Don't miss it. Um, I'm sure you got value from tonight. So you get even more value from the next session. Have a wonderful night, everybody. Thank you so much and good night. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank good you, night. everyone. Have a good night, everyone. Good night. 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 Good night.